how do you determine the limiting reagent? First, I want you to make sure you know what a limiting reagent is. When they ask you what the limiting reagent is, that's the same as asking you. When the chemical reaction happens, which reactant will you run out of first? Which do you have the least of? And you always need two things to calculate what the limiting reagent is. You need a balanced chemical equation and you need the amounts of each reactant that you have. So here's the chemical equation. Did you check to see if it was balanced? Yes, we did. We have a balanced chemical equation and let's say we have the amounts of each. Let's say we have 0.25 moles of CH4 and 1.25 moles of O2. Which of these is going to be the limiting reagent? Well, let's start with CH4. How much O2 do we need if we're going to use up all of the CH4? We use up two oxygen molecules for every molecule of CH4 that we use up. So we're going to need 2 times 0.25 moles of O2 if we're going to use up all the CH4. We have much more than that. We have much more than 0.5 moles of O2. Therefore, we're going to use up all of the CH4 before we use up all of the O2 and we say that CH4 is the limiting reagent.